The £6 million MRI scanner has arrived here in Cardiff. At the moment, Cardiff University's Brain Research Imaging Centre is based here in Park Place. Soon, they'll be moving to a brand new building over in Mandy Road. The scanner has already arrived there. It was put in place over the weekend. Yeah, well, this is a fantastic uh, news for us, the arrival of this uh, 7 Tesla magnet. We received money from the MRC, £6.7 million, pounds, uh, to fund this. It's the third one uh, in the UK, and it really puts Cardiff on the map for neuroimaging research. And it's a, a huge um, piece of equipment, isn't it? That's right. So it weighs approximately 40 tonnes. It came on a low loader on Saturday morning, uh, and we had a massive crane uh, in the sunshine to offload our shiny new magnet uh, into the new centre. It was a big operation, wasn't it? It was a big operation, yeah. There were uh, a number of uh, lorries there. There was a very tall crane. There were about 50 of us uh, from the research centre who came out to watch uh, this thing being delivered. So it was an exciting morning. Now, the building's open uh, next spring, so I guess now the next step is it'll have to be hooked up. And, and uh, What sort of process now do you need to get it working, get it underway? OK, well, the, the magnet uh, contains a lot of liquid helium. It has to be kept extremely cold so that it maintains its superconducting properties. Um, it will need filling with more helium, so uh, several thousand litres of helium needs to go in, which is, uh, apart from anything else, very expensive. The rest of the room needs to be built around it, so the wall needs to go back onto the building. And then our imaging suite needs to be put together around the magnet, because it's such a big device that it goes into the building and then the building is finished off around it. And when it's uh, operational, when you're in there next year, obviously, what sort of things will, will, will this be able to discover? Because it, it's, it's such a magnificent bit of equipment. Isn't it? What's the key behind it to discovering things? So the key, the key really to this piece of equipment is that it's, um, it's about four times more powerful than the kind of standard MRI system that you would find in your, uh, your local hospital. That means that it, we can get much better resolution in our images. It's a bit like the number of megapixels on your, on your mobile phone. We can get much more detail but also we can look at chemicals in the brain so we can look at how the brain functions using spectroscopy those chemicals imbalances for example tell us about diseases which are so far not well understood things like psychiatric conditions such as depression but also we'll be looking in much more detail at diseases like Alzheimer's and multiple sclerosis in the future because there are so many things about the brain we don't understand and this machine I guess will help explain some of those maybe. Exactly and that's uh, exactly the brain is is the big unknown really it remains a huge scientific challenge for us and this is why the MRC has invested uh, its funds um, in our scanner and in other scanners across the UK to really unlock the secrets of the brain. And obviously this is one of the, the best scanners you can have. How, how, how much does this put Cardiff on the map? So this is really uh, uh, puts Cardiff on the map at, at an international level. It makes us uh, a, a key imaging hub within Europe. It will be one of the largest centres within the UK and only one of maybe two or three across Europe with this, this range of equipment. And again, the knock-on effects for Cardiff as a city and, and for the university will be tremendous, won't they? Absolutely. So the, the funding that we, that we brought into Kubrick will we'll be looking for approximately 40 new researchers over the next year or so. Uh, so there's a big increase in, in really high-tech, uh, uh, technology-led uh, research here in Cardiff, which will be good for the local economy as well. And also putting Cardiff at the forefront of that kind of research, the things that could be discovered here. It's very exciting times ahead. That's right, it, it is. I mean, Cardiff University came uh, very high in the rankings uh, in, the, in, in the recent uh, research excellence framework exercise. And this really builds on that position so that we will be up there in the top research centres in the UK and across Europe. And obviously we're here in the main Cardiff University buildings now, but when, when does the move take place? It's sometime next year. When, when are you expecting yeah. to sort of decamp over That's there? That's right. So our, our magnets, um, the new magnets are being uh, installed now. The building will be finished uh, in December, and then we have a lot of testing to do before we're up and ready. But we'll actually move into the new building in March next year. So the brand new scanner weighing 40 tonnes is now in place in the new Kubrick building right behind me. This will open in spring next year.